Y'all, welcome to Nashville, Music City, USA, where all my dreams have been fulfilled. And how amazing is it that with Plexus, that I get to do music on top of that and get to share at convention. <laughs> I'm already living a musician's dream, having gotten to sing at the MGM Grand and all those places. Anything is possible. I remember moving here and thinking, anything is literally possible. Music brought me here, I was about 23, um, and I told my parents, I said, I think I'm ready to move to Nashville. Um, I had sang in Cross Canada for five years, professionally, that's all I did, and um, they said, okay, but don't you get married down there, and sure enough, I got married and ended up having you know, four little babies and living on a farm, so my life just kind of changed. I think she does such a great job using her talents. She uses them especially, I guess. She is confident and she works hard and she um, helps you with your feelings. She takes really good care and she's really nice. Well, let me tell you a story. I joined Plex as Unsure and just unsure of myself and unsure of what was going to happen and unsure of if I could do something like this. I jumped all in because I was excited about these products. I'd been with Plexus for about nine months and my husband unexpectedly passed away. I had four children under the age of six years old and my world was shattered. And every event, every opportunity I get, I shout from the rooftops this opportunity. The products drew me in, but this opportunity changed my ever-loving life. And to know that there are people out there who are sitting in my shoes, sitting in my circumstances, my sole mission is to say you can grow through the grief, you can overcome, you can rise up, and you can build an incredible business that impacts lives, impacts hearts, and impacts children. My children watched me go through loss after loss and what they saw was a strong plexus community of people that checked on me supported me showed up for me through the hardest time of our life well i met the love of my life i met a man and he fits everything that my late husband prayed for my husband's late wife passed away too and so you know we came to the table very similar circumstances and to love those kids is a holy honor. I cannot, literally cannot imagine my life without them. <laughs> he is my double portion. He melts me. He absolutely melts me and um, encourages me to be me. And what's next is a fresh start for our families and to make a difference in the world around us. Let's go. So I'm gonna introduce you guys to all the children who are amazing. We have Gager, he's the youngest. Can you say hi? We got Dawson right here. Hi. Ava. Hi. We got Relin. Hi. Wyatt. Hi. This is Emmy. Hello. And Nolan. Hi. And this is my husband, Rodney. Gone from a place of hurting heavy grieving to now you're growing, you know, and you're becoming somebody you always believed you could be, but you never really were, you know, and uh, that's, that's what she's done for me, you know, and she challenges me in the best ways, um, believes in me like no one else has ever believed in me, you know, she's just such a powerful uh, force. <laughs> it's changed my life in pretty much just for the better. It's been awesome. It's, um, as the parents say, it's, you know, we're the double portion. You know, after we've lost, we're just kind of, we get double, you know, double for your trouble and stuff. It's been really great. I've instantly connected with all the kids. Uh, I've really enjoyed just getting to help them through little things, starting from school, just chores, just little daily things along with big picture stuff like 
just coping with a new family. Um, it helps other people, and she's nice. We kind of envision just a really precious kind of getaway um, out here, just to do all the things. So, and then our house is going to be right back here. We just want a place for the kids to run and and get to do all the fun things. So get to let them be kids for a little while. We just keep saying life is short and we will enjoy this time and this season of life and, and slow down and live life to the fullest because so many people don't have the perspective that we get to have. And so as much as it, it's hard and it hurt, it's a gift too that you can pull from. Loss is that you get to come out the other side and it's been world changing, world changing. They're the most amazing community ever. They've inspired me, encouraged me, uplifted me, and made me believe that I could do this. She's one of those people that builds you up, that you can call up and just say, hey, I'm struggling with this. But she doesn't just listen, she gives you something to build from. She will build belief in you when there's not any there. <laughs> I want to say, Alita will make you believe you can climb a mountain with two broke legs. <laughs> She's the real deal. She is the kind of person that you want going out and sharing change and opportunity with the world. She is love. She is trust. She's integrity. She is the best thing that could happen to Plexus. Crazy passion, crazy dreams, but showing you the way that those dreams are actually possible. I feel like that's really what she's done for us, um, is that we just didn't even realize what we were capable of until she came into our life. She's inspired me to be me. Not to be her, not to be the next person, not to be anybody else. But I feel like she is what drew out of me what is most me. There's just no excuse. It doesn't matter what's happening in her life, she's going to rise up. And what happens when she does that is her team follows suit. You're like our very own Alita, and I love and adore you, and you're such an inspiration. And I just thank you for being that light to all of us, even when you are struggling through hard times. You have used your story to inspire thousands and thousands of people, and no one deserves this more than you do. No one. So proud of you. I love you. You know how much. And we have been better people for knowing you. And and we could not be prouder of you. Yeah. Could not. Yeah, we love you, Alita. We love you. Mom, I love you. You're so special to everyone you meet. You're such a light. You're essential. You're essential to everything you touch. Mom, I love you. Lots. I love you, Mom. It's just amazing that you've gotten this far and even though I wasn't here for the entire journey, I'm glad I'm here now. I never saw you coming. You were everything I ever wanted and, and, and more. Nothing I expected, everything I wanted. You care deeper than anyone I've ever met. You love stronger than anything I've ever known. You are, you are everything to me. And I'm just so excited to get to do life with you and just be a part of your life and meet you where you're at and, be your, your helpmate for the rest of our lives. And I love you with all my heart. We love you!